My, my Nigerian beauties, you know. <laughs> Are you alright? I'm alright. Okay. How about you? You alright? I'm okay. Like, which personality do you want me to bring in place? Do you want me to bring my British? <laughs> Harry Cavill? What's my... your name to start with? My name, but well, I'm Ekene. Right now you're Ekene, so stick to the evil version of you. Hi, my name is AJ, A for Apple J for Juice, but you can like to call me Apple Juice Say. And I'm here with Ekene. Ekene, that's not oh my God. Ekene the new chuku. No, no, Ekene. No, they don't delete chuku to my name. What's the full name? Ekene. Essential. What's the surname? Ngoka, don't bite your tongue. So Ekene Ngoka. Ngoka. Feel free to, if you have any questions, okay. ask me as well. No more, hold on. While we dig into the chicken. Okay. I don't want to soil my hair. I would like to, you know, dig deep with my fingers, you know, make it oily. Wow, you like to dig deep yeah, yeah. with your fingers. Dig deep, yeah, you know how it works. I feel they should see my eye for this expression. What kind of chicken have you been eating? <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get this from? Sounds very Pizza Hut. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're not doing an advert for them. Let's rate it. It's like it's chicken like, like without pepper. Yeah, without pepper. Should I bring pepper? No, no, no. I don't eat it. Yeah, I'm seven over ten, yeah. Another time? Nah. Okay. I grew better chicken. This is like uh, five over ten. Yeah, I like to taste the chicken. Though. And I'm my not... chicken tastes really good. I love to taste the chicken. I love. <laughs> you know, I'm naturally high. I do not need to take alcohol to be high. Mm. So. Hey, you have this free flowing spirit that I can never have the middle. Okay. Jesus Christ. You enter. Oof, yeah. You enter. To start first. Mm -hmm. Should we do like coin toss? Uh, you have coin, Abby. <laughs> Why are you carrying coin around? What How is much is that? 20 pence. 20 pence. Till. Till. Start first. That's how it works. Mm -hmm. What is your full name? What does each name mean? What's my full name? Adjumo Kechuku Beatrice Mwenze. But if you call me Beatrice, I will kill you. Oh, you <laughs> so Ajumo Kechuku means I will not reject God's gift. That's where the AJ comes from because the first two. Ajumo. I just think it's so zero, but when I see your name on the list, I see like Ajumo Ke, yeah. Ajumo Ke, Ajumo Ke. I just think, oh, she's zero, wow. okay. Beatrice means someone who always makes people happy, and that's like my job. Wow. And then Mwenze means um, daughter of a king. Wow, so yeah. you're a princess. I am actually a princess. So she just call you princess. I'm That's actually a princess. princess. Yeah. So if you marry now, I'll have blood, or my children will have real yeah. blood. Oh, yeah. that makes sense. Man. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> okay. Um. Uh, we should get some basha. I do the same. It's just that I need some more pepper. See, I put pepper in everything, even my tea. <laughs> Very soon, I'll put pepper inside this drink. Okay. Um, what is the biggest cultural shock that you faced coming here? Uh, a lot of people don't wash their Snickers, you know. They don't wash You're them. going too far. You, you have a British flatmate, yeah? Yeah. How often does he take the shower? Anytime he uses the shower, I notice he turns it from hot to cold. And the last time that thing was turned on, turned from hot to cold was that's the shower cap. I think that was like three weeks ago. <laughs> Okay, one thing that I understand here is that those excuses we give in Nigeria. So yeah. some excuses that you don't want to hear that story. Yeah, there's no story. Just do your job. Just do your job. I'm yeah. paying you for your job, so do it. Something is happening. Send me a text right away that yeah. this is what is happening. This is why I'm stuck. This is what's going on. And that's one thing that I have come to understand here. People in power are very simple. They are like yeah, everything. Apart from Rishi Sunak, he's Rishi is my guy. Yeah, but he likes to fly. You know. He's he's so slick. He's very eloquent. He's very, 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 very sound. Yeah, very. very sound. I, I like his brain. He's like, Mr. Speaker, that's not that's not what we're talking about. <laughs> when we're talking about the healthcare facilities in the United <laughs> Kingdom. Yeah, I know that kind of thing. Oh, yeah. Talks, yeah, yeah. When I'm shooting my film, you're gonna play the British black guy. Really, really. No, I, I could do multiple accents. I could do the Ghanaian accent. Oh, yeah, do that. Let's see. No. Do, do it. If I start. The accent, the bus will just come and just take everybody out. <laughs> it's like, do you get compliments for your voice? Mm, a lot of people, a lot of people, yeah, girls. Oh right, right, right from when I'm in Cal, I was in Cal, but you've got a nice voice. Mm -hmm. I know, I know. You know, you, have you ever considered um, doing something with a voice like 
being a voiceover artist, uh, being a presenter, doing podcasts, because you got a voice that a girl would want to hear all the time. That takes some voice out because it's setting in right yeah. now, you know, I love it. Yeah, so I think you should think about monetizing. Anything that you have as a get was given for a reason. And if you have a fine voice, you have a fine taste as well, and you have a good height. You should maximize these three things. And what do you think you can do with your voice, your face, and your height? Smash girls. Wow. I never saw that coming. No, 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 I'm just joking. Well, you know, to be the better carrier for myself, I could be talking in the Premier League, you know? Yeah. But, hello, today, welcome to Boy Stadium, you know? We're talking about the Premier League seven. Just do an introduction like you're on BBC. Yeah. Hi, my name is Ken Allen Walker. Welcome to BBC. Today we'll be talking about AJ, how she's trying hot shit on the president, Rishi Sunak. <laughs> Join me later in the next five minutes when we're going on a recess break. You know what I mean? Ken Allen Walker, don't touch that down. <laughs> <laughs> that was beautiful. When we went to Jam Rock, I met some girls, and the girls were like, you sound more English than us. Oh wow, I like yeah. that. That's the compliment you gave me. Yeah, that's a good compliment. What has been your most successful pickup line? Well, that's... Okay, okay, okay. If I see someone I admire, okay. male or female, regardless of gender, I would flash a smile to you. That's like the first um, step of my communication. Like a fucking smile. Yeah. I would smile to you to let you know that I see you. And then, if there's an opportunity, I will walk up to you and strike a conversation. You know I'm good at that, right? Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, no, you no, know no, that. No, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know. Because yeah. I feel like there are some people you meet once in a lifetime. Again, yeah. So I do not postpone an opportunity to say hi to someone I just met because I'm not sure I'm going to meet that person again. That reminds me. I was coming back from work one time. I met, there were two girls I just entered the door. She was just looking at me all through. Oh my like, I don't, I don't want to overrate myself, but as I walked down, I told my guys, she did look me. Because the guys now said, she did look you now from the bus up. <laughs> then I just thought that she was looking at me from the bus. I was like, what the fuck? And you didn't say hi, you didn't I, smile. I didn't say hi. You didn't smile, I, I didn't, didn't smile, wink at her. Yeah, she was, this girl was fine. You should have winked or smiled or just waved or something, reciprocate. This girl was the fine, eyes. guys. She was really fine. Like. So what stopped you? I was coming back from work, I was tired, you know. The truth of the matter is, when you're complimenting a girl, compliment her like you really meant it. Mm. That's what I feel. Yeah. And maybe you look at them, there are things you do with your eyes, <laughs> the way you talk, mm. the way you just look at them, you mm. look at them with that confidence and you see it. Uh, uh, you you just look at you like, you're really beautiful. You mm. look great. It sounds like a scam anyway. It's not a scam, but you know. You'd be like, oh my god, you're complimenting me too much, you know, that's girls like, oh my god, like, <laughs> And it works for you. It, work, it works, like, you, all the time. And then in text messages too, you know, just... You're a writer, so you would kill them with words. You're a badass writer, you use words. Yeah. Have you ever been in a situation where you feel like you are overusing your skill to get something from a girl? Yeah, sometimes I use my lines. Sometimes mm. I steal lines from songs. Oh my god. So. Well, it's always beautiful if you use a line from a song and the girl is not aware that it's from a song. Yeah. But once she knows it's from a song and oh my god. Well, even if the girl knows the song, it's about the guy having the game. That's the basis. Mm. That really just communicate with your girl. Be free, be confident. That's really good. Okay, if you were to meet a girl right now, okay. let's say on the streets, and you meet a girl and you really want to get her attention, what would you do? What would you say to her? So I'll be like, I'm really sorry, I'm going to be intruding on your time, your personal time and everything. I think you're really beautiful. I've had like the biggest crush on you in the last 30 seconds. I would like to, you know, I'd like to take you out for dinner sometime, like yeah. tomorrow or something. Straight up like that? Yeah. Okay. Be very intentional. Be confident. The girl doesn't really, she's not going to just turn you down like that. I swear to God. <laughs> You don't know how this thing works. A few days ago, I was coming back from school and I saw a black guy. He was trying to get my attention and I was on the phone. And so I paused to give him attention because I felt like he was lost. And he goes, oh. And he saw me and he liked me. I'm like, where did you see me? He said, just right now as I was working. And I'm like, okay. I wanted to ask him how old he was because he really looked young. But I didn't ask him. I was like, oh, are you in school? And he said, yes. 
<laughs> and I'm like, what department? Now, the funny part about this whole thing is he's not a master's student. He's an undergrad. And he's not just an undergraduate student. There's the foundation one year that you do before you get into the undergrad. So he's a small boy. <sighs> like, I wanted to ask him, does your mommy know you're out right now? <laughs> Me and my cousin, we were, we were walking just on the alley. And we saw some Nigerian boys right in front of us. Mm. And you know, these ones are undergrad. Mm. We're like, those master students said they still form. I don't understand. We made it before. I right? said, <laughs> like... you put me away in the crease. Three things that will make you say yes to an opposite sex, regardless of what she looks like. Without the physical attributes. Yeah, I'm without the physical attributes. <sighs> she must be kind. Must be Am kind. I kind? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> reasonable level she is. Uh, uh... <laughs> when you say reasonable level, what do you mean? You're a kind person, I know. You yeah. offer help, you know. That's one good thing about her. She can help you. She can read your work, you know, that kind of thing. Yeah. She can provide time. Yeah, she can like talk that. to you when you're lonely. You oh, know. wow. Like therapy. Yeah, therapy. When I was in Dartford, I needed to just talk to somebody. I talked to, yeah. But <laughs> that, well, I think it was one hour call that we yeah, had, yeah. And yeah. really good, yeah. Mm. She's really kind. Um, the girl must be passionate about something. Something that, that might just make me intrigued in it. Something that she would just use like capture my attention. Are she know. interested in horror movies? No, I do not like horror movies. <laughs> well, my ex likes horror movies. So Did it, you used to watch it with her? She forced me to watch one or two, you know. Well, I really don't get it about horror movies and why people like to scare themselves. Yep. To them, it's not scary. Yeah, it's not As scary. That's how most horror films are not scary, but to me, it is terrible. I found out that <clears throat> one thing that makes a horror movie really scary is the sound. So one day I decided to intentionally watch a horror movie. I put off the sound and I realized that I wasn't scared anymore. Just looking at the visuals without the sound, without those mm -hmm, all mm -hmm, those things. Man, it's a like it was okay. So suspense, the sound yeah. is the main thing that makes it horror. Have you seen this film, um, Quiet Place? I don't think I have. Well, it's horror trailer. Emily Blunt was about to give birth. There's this scene where she was about to give birth. And then you're not supposed to shout. The film was quiet. Part one was quiet all mm. through. No sounds. Wow. So you're not supposed to shout or talk. If you're not that thing, yeah. the monster will hear you. So she was about to give birth. And the Ooh. thing was creeping up. I, it was on the staircase there. And she was like on the sink in the back. How do you give birth without screaming? That's the point. Oh my God. So what happened? Like my heart was doing gun, 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 gun. <laughs> She did give birth. What's what happened per se, but what's the name of the movie again? The quiet place. The quiet place yeah, sounds crazy. Okay, so she must be kind, she must be passionate about something and it doesn't have to be horror fame. And she must love movies. Yeah, because you're a movie person. I am a movie person. That's how I really connect. Okay. Movies connect people, songs to connect yeah. people. I'm a song person. I'm a movie person. I okay. think. Right, movie for 2023. Mm -hmm. You guys should go and watch it. What movie is that? Tetris. Okay, what's it about? It's about how Tetris, the game, came about. I would not be interested. Thank no, you. you would think you would not be interested. At first, I was like, oh, it's going to be normal biopic of plenty talk talk. Mm -hmm. But you now start seeing things like Soviet Union, America, going there, KGB, CIA. For Tetris, I'm like. Is it a feature film or a series? It's a picture film. Oh, okay. Taran Egerton, you know Taran Egerton? Yeah. yeah. It's I'll a good film. It. It's like the best movie this okay. year. Even when I put it on Twitter, a lot of people say, yes, you know films, please recommend more movies for okay. me. Okay. I think yeah. we should do like movie reviews. Yeah, we should yeah. do that. Yeah. Send down the rain. Who sang Send Down the Rain? Sorry, which Send Down the Rain are you singing right now? I don't know. You are singing Send Down the Rain. What song is that? That's my own. Okay, my, my own I, I understand. You say you don't do, I don't do songs. songs. That's no. Send Down the Rain. Send it's an down. old song, yeah. Send Down the Rain. Yeah, not Send Down the Rain. Yeah. Do you know it? No, I do You've not. You've never heard of Send Down the Rain? I've never heard of Send Down the Rain. I will shoot you. And I'll die. <laughs> <laughs> Send Down the Rain is a popular song by Magic Fashek. Oh, I know Magic Fashek, but uh -huh. I don't know any of his songs. So. Mm. This is a chicken break. Why are you doing mm, mm. Mm. The chicken is not that sweet, bro. This is like Chicken Republic. 
Yo bro, no. I like uh, mega chicken better. Oh, mega, I miss mega chicken. Oh miss, my god. Yeah, ajoke rice. Oh my god, that's my best rice. No, ajoke rice is um tasty fried chicken. I swear, I also went to like come from Nigeria and just bring that rice. What I want right now from Nigeria in terms of food is roasted catfish from Entice. Oh. Entice, the good life. It's a lounge in VI. That fish is bad. Um, that's that's like from the airport straight to entire yeah, Never have I ever stopped gum under a table, chair, or bed. That would be Obvious. like. I'm not really big on gum, but yeah, right I would have done it, but I can't remember. I know you're an art student because we're classmates, yeah? But yeah. do you know science? Uh, yeah, I got a little bit, tiny, tiny bit of knowledge. Because this question I'm about to ask you. Okay, what is the closest planet to Earth? Closest to Earth? Mm. I know we have Venus before Earth and we have um, Mars before, after Earth. Mm. So I do not know which one is the closest, but so I'll say Venus. You actually are correct. Do you want to talk about more about yourself? Sell yourself. You never can tell. Uh, We're in the same field, yeah. Uh, well, I did a lot of acting um, on stage in University of Calabar. Yeah. And I did also in Calabar also. So some of my plays. I did a short movie. I'm just gonna do more. Yeah. You know, but I'm You were myself. you were on set with us when we were shooting the curator. Yeah. Yeah, and he did the backstage photography and photography. Even in NYC, during the NYC, like he wanted to help me move because I acted so well, oh. you know? So if you're a Nigerian director, mm. a producer, mm -hmm. watching this, mm -hmm. and you Sorry, have okay. links to Netflix Nigeria, <laughs> you've got your guy. What about Netflix UK? Netflix UK also, you've got your guy. Yeah. You know me? <laughs> Don't touch that down. I can Okay, it's been yeah, an amazing so time. Enough. I'll just take all of the sip, because I think I'm beginning to see double. Me I think you're wearing nice. red. <laughs> And you mm. have afro and you have glasses on. Am I right? Yeah, you're right. Am yeah. I right? Yeah, you're right. Good, I knew I was right. So the alcohol is setting in. And so, at this point, I will say thank you yeah. for the chicken. It's just for my, don't mention it. I thank you guys for watching. Cheers. Thank you, ciao. Mm -hmm. ciao.